Hello everyone, thank you for choosing EQ Maker Card DIY 4 in 1 3D printer. So many of us don't know how to operate this machine. So in this video we will show, show you how to operate this machine in a proper way. So after receiving the machine, please read the email that we have sent it to you describing how to upgrade the last firmware and software updates. After that we can start. After you unbox the machine, you will find four tool head. In this case, we take FDM tool head. So now we are going to connect this wire to this tool head. After that, we will connect this to mounting slot with this arm, and then we will put a screw to make it tight. This is a soft magnetic plate. When you work with a FDM tool head or FDM dual tool head, you must have to set up this with this platform like this. Now we are going to connect this filament tube to this tool head. connected to the back side like this now we will put this filament into this filament tube for this you need to push this up and put the filament inside like this you can see it's going up and you need to load it until it's reached this red level now we will connect this power to this machine and after that we will turn on the power switch you can see it's lighting up and the screen is coming and when you first time work with this FDM tool head or change the tool head into FDM tool head you must have to change the G offset so in this manual you can see the Z offset value and we have a video to show how to set the Z offset you can also see this video for details load the filament go to the filament section then go to the load filament option and filament 1 now it's loading the filament you can hear the sound after done with this process, you need to download our last version of our if you or software from our official website and then you need to install it to your computer and now we are going to show you how to operate the software and how to process your model using our EQ or software. So let's move on to this. Here you can change the position, size, rotation, angle and place the model horizontally to the bottom plane select the FDM tool head don't forget to choose the support now slice it now save the file please give a name and the name should be in English and save it to SD card. Now we are going to print a model. So this is the SD card. So we, after we pre, uh, put the SD card, so we will move on to the print from SD. So we will choose the which model we want to print. We have finished our printing. This is the printing we have done. You can see it looks very cute. So now I am going to take it out from the soft magnetic plate. You see it's coming very crispy. So we just need to remove it from the, you can see it looks very cute. So if you have any questions during the printing and 
you can contact to us with our facebook group ecube maker user community and you can also email us thank you so much for choosing ecube maker toy diy 4 in 1 3d printer enjoy your creation